It's a trope in our society that student housing is rubbish. It's just a thing we all say and all recognise, and it's kind of, actually, does it have to be that way? Students are poor consumers of housing. They're not around long enough to affect any actual changes in the markets, and landlords are just ripping us all off. At the end of the day, you're living in somebody else's property that they just own so as to make money from you. They just set their prices so high and there's no alternative, or at least people don't think there is any alternative. Student Housing Co-op is a student house that's owned by its students, it's self-managed. We're democratically run by our members and in doing so we provide better quality housing and we're also able to bring costs right down to offer cheaper housing than the alternatives. Not only is it like cheaper, but the money you're paying is going to the actual upkeep of the house, like all of it, which just leads to like a much higher quality of accommodation. There is no landlord, we are the landlords, we're in charge. If we wanted to paint something or make a mural, we can do it. We want to drill into the wall to put a picture up, we can do it. We want to put a satellite up, we can do it, we don't have to ask anyone. It was just an empty wet space without anything there. We took a flooring out and then we had to put on new walls and new floors and new waterproofing. And now there's a shower in it. This was a garage two years ago. This one we're in right now, we're in the process of now renovating into that more appropriate usable space. Just got such a spread of very interesting people doing very interesting things. It's like a whole world in one building. It's very like spontaneous in the way that sometimes someone's making food and then like here five people walk past your window and then you invite them in and then you have a big dinner together. So there's a really nice sense of community. There's lots of nice people who live here. It definitely changes the way you go about how you relate to people what your ambitions are in life is hugely formative and I think it is for a lot of people who live here. And I've just met so many amazing people and just bounced off so many ideas. Uh, I think it's just really enabled me to grow as a person and to think about how we can apply this to other areas of our life as well. We can actually take on the landlords and the problem system that we're living under. 